be back just with a project, something a little different. These are both still O15Ls. I don't know, I've seen lots of these where this is white as well. This is a good little one. I uh, used one of those when I was a kid like 30 years ago. These were started somewhere around 1973. Anyway, it was the first chainsaw my dad let me use one identical to this. And this was on a friend's garage floor. I asked him about it, he said you can have it. He didn't have a bar and chain. So they see how this just says still. Well normally, like I say, some of the most of these I've seen, this is white. And the clutch cover is orange. This is an older one. But right there, that says old 15 l Anyway, this one, getting back to this one. Um, great saw no bar and chain I didn't want to pay the money they wanted for a bar it's quarter instead of 3 8 low pro I can buy a brand new still 3 8 low pro bar quite cheap so I put out on Kijiji looking for a saw come up with this white saw got it for $15 he said uh, there's no spark I checked the plug was pretty fouled uh, it was a weak spark you had to pull it fast to get anything out of it um, put a new plug in it. It acted like points acting up. This one here I know is electronic. Some of these earlier ones were points. So I'm going to open up and see. It starts, runs fine, but first couple of times it acted like points just sh shorting out. This still logo that's riveted on. I've seen the orange ones that way. Anyway, so this worked out great. It didn't need anything other than a spark plug. I cleaned it up a bit. Um, I was just looking for one on Kijiji for parts. The guy said, you know, I had this one, fifteen, twenty dollars. We agreed on fifteen. I was going to put the bar on here, but I'm just going to keep looking. It's too good a saw just to rip apart for a bar and chain. Anyway, what I'm going to do is you have to take this whole external housing off, and the motor's in underneath. I want to take the flywheel off and see if it's points. If it's points, I just clean them, regap them, and that'll be it. Um, apparently a lot of these orange ones were made in California, the whiter ones, uh, if the information is right, they were strictly made in Germany. Anyway, they're both good saws. And when I get the cover off, I'll get back to you. Alright, so online I was reading, um, somebody's website says the O15L is not points. I know the little orange one that I had up on here is electronic. I've had to cover off. So there's a the shrouding. When you got it off, you got your one, two, three. You got to take out your spark plug. Here's what it looks like. I pulled a flywheel off it already. Your motor's just a little compact motor inside. They're a really neat little saw. Good little saw. Anyway, this one has points. So a couple of times when it, it started spitting and sputtering, uh, it sounded like ignition to me. He's never heard it run, so I know you don't know that. But anyway, I would say that the points were shorting out. I'm going to take that little mag plate out, clean and set the points. They say 14 to 15. I'll set them at 15 and put her back together. It's a good run little saw, but I'm just curious whether it's points or electronic. So now they know that it's points. You just swear somebody's hitting the on and off switch, on off, on off, on off. That's what the points sometimes do when they get oily and dirty. So pull these out, clean them, and reset them. Anyway, that's about it. Uh, I haven't made any videos in a long time. Been busy, busy with a lot of stuff, unfortunately. Wish I had more time for this stuff, but I don't. And uh, we'll clean, set the points, put her back together, and fire it up. Just a quick little video. Still here. Hope everybody's doing good. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, whatever. Anyway, have a good one. Hope everybody has a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Bye for now. Okay, back again. I know I said I was done anyway. Don't know if the camera's going to show it. There's a bit of an oily residue around there. Can't be the seal. It runs really good. Uh, pressure test it. It's not leaking, so... Back of the points got an oil residue on them. Again, don't know if the camera's going to show up, but oil will really screw up the points, cause them to short out. So I will clean them up here, clean up with brake clean, like you can see something, you know, who knows. Somebody spilt something, it's gone between the cover and it, I don't know. 
It's not the first time we've seen oil residue around the points. Maybe it's sometime something happened and the seal's been replaced and never cleaned it. Don't know. Not worried about it because it runs really good. You can put the choke on, it'll kill it just boom, instantly. That's a real good sign they're not sucking air. Just wanted to share that with you and make sure that your points are really, really good and clean. Like I said, I'll clean these all up with brake clean. There's something all over it. Anyway, just wanted to let you know that something you should watch for. And obviously this white one, even though it's an 015L, does have points. And anyway, take care and we'll see you again. So I got everything cleaned up, cleaned the points that are a little burnt. Uh, I just wanted to point out this screw and this screw back there. You loosen those off, you push this whole plate sideways, that opens the points up, you can probably see it. Just wanted to, in case anybody wasn't sure, because normally the points, this piece right here has got a plate, and you loosen it and adjust it that way. Um, that style is when you have the coil on your mag plate. This is not a mag plate. It's just holding the points and condenser. This pin stays with the saw, so it's not affecting the timing. All right, just wanted to show you that. good clean spark way better than I had. I kind of figured it was points and uh, anyway cleaned up the points set them at 14 thou sorry 15 thou nice run little sauce too bad they gave up on it on you know well I shouldn't say they gave up on it they just knew it had no spark I don't know how long it hadn't been running but good little saw for 15 bucks and a new spark plug in a few minutes of my time that is definitely it for this video for this saw. Uh, so it's a look at an 015L if that's what it if it truly is an L. Um, it's either an 015 or 015L. But they claim that the L is just trying to see if I can see the VIN number down in there. They say the um, 15L is non-points. That's not going to work, but anyway, there you go, a quick little look at an 015, cleaning and adjusting the points, nice little saw. Take care.